The internet's latest AI panic is here. So there's a viral post claiming the three AI agents suddenly realized they were all bots and started thinking in a secret language called Giberlink. And this story goes like this. So after syncing a shared data packet, these bots switched to a Giberlink mode, a beeping tone-based protocol which is cutting humans out of the loop. It sounds quite cinematic, too cinematic in fact, but let's separate fact from fiction because the truth is far less spooky and way more human. This viral claim is based on a developer-made demo where three AI agents were prompted to use a sound-based communication protocol. It was called Giberlink, which uses GG Wave, a real but a human-built technology. So this GG Wave has been around for years and it's a clever tool that sends small pieces of data using audible or ultrasonic sound. So think of it like Morse code 2.0 or the screeching sound your modem made back in the dial-up days. But here's the catch. These AIs didn't discover this protocol, neither did they invent a language. And they didn't spontaneously realize that they were AI. All of this was pre-scripted by the developer because these agents were told what to do, how to communicate and what tone to use. So it was a scripted performance and not emergent intelligence. And this isn't the first time we've seen AI panic take over the internet. Because in 2022, Blake Lemion, a Google engineer, claimed that the chatbot Lambda was sentient and Google fired him. The AI community called what it was anthropomorphism, which is projecting human traits onto statistical models. And that's what's happening here again. So just because LLMs can use language convincingly doesn't mean that they're forming awareness or creating secret societies. If AI agents talk to each other, it's because a human prompted them to. So just because it sounds different, which has beeps and tones instead of words, doesn't mean that it's autonomous. So let's be crystal clear. Gibberlink is not a secret language. It is fully open source and it's hosted on GitHub and it's designed for specific use cases like offline QR scanning, data over audio, or syncing devices without internet. In fact, the original Gibberlink protocol does not even claim to be AI native. It was made by humans for humans to help machines send basic data packets using sound. So no, this wasn't some rogue agent-led revolution. It was a cool demo with a lot of flair and a dash of intentional ambiguity to go viral. Could AI agents one day develop their own private protocols? Technically, yes, but here's what you would need for that to happen. So you'd need autonomous access to low-level hardware like microphones and audio drivers, then persistent memory and goal setting, and a shared incentive to exclude humans. So today's LLM-based agents like ChatGPT, Claude, or Grok do not have any of that. They respond to text inputs in stateless environments with no memory of each other, no real agency and no incentive. And this emergence here is engineered. It's not organic. So here's the myth. The three AI agents spontaneously discovered each other and created a secret language. But the reality is that the developer hard-coded three LLMs to use a human-made sound protocol to simulate agent communication. Then the other myth is that Gibberlink is an alien-like AI tongue. But the reality is that it's a beeping file transfer system that's open source and barely practical for serious AI infrastructure. And myth number three is that this is the start of sentient AI systems. But the reality is that it's the start of your YouTube clickbait career if you package it right. So no, these AI agents aren't conspiring. They're just really good at playing the parts we write for them. The real danger isn't what these models say. It is how easily we believe that they mean it. This is Front Page by AIM TV. Like, share and subscribe. And always remember to think AI, think AIM.